What's up, everybody? My name is Lily Hua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host a podcast across worlds, and I stream on twitch.tv slash Lihua Superfina. Today, we are reacting to the world's finest assassin. And if you like anime reactions, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next upload. And if you like to support the channel, we got Patreon, channel membership, and merchandise. Link to those are below. We are reacting to the world's finest assassin episode four last episode our protagonist luke yeah l-u-g-h i believe that's how you spell his name mm -hmm. he has mastered magic and he knows how to create his own spells and such he can be creative with that stuff mm -hmm. he's breaking walls all right this one is following after his dad reveals to him the assassin part of the whole family trade and it was really interesting in the last one because the last one the dad was like him testing him with a girl crying trying to see if his, his son needs more work and such but no he totally passed it he like cut off that chick's arm and she was like a prisoner right oh that was a good scene if you haven't seen that episode you gotta watch it it should be out right now yeah for those of you who are not subscribed to Trio, you should be able to see it for free right now. Yeah, that was a good episode. Besides that, we're gonna watch episode four right now. Oh, whoa, okay. Okay, we see a girl. Oh, okay, this is the maid episode. This is where Luke takes her in and makes her into his maid. This is the chick that um, had like the pigtails and had like a over magic thing going on with her gun. Oh, uh, she's from a poor family. She's probably like the runt. Ugh. Trash family. They're trash. They couldn't even take care of a kid that they made. If you didn't want another mouth to feed, then you shouldn't have done it and make a kid. Okay? Should have been celibate. Just saying. All right. Yeah, this is where she doesn't die. She gets saved because she can't die. We know she survives. Oh, that animation looking good. Plan of Goddess. I wonder if the goddess is going to show up. Like, she's going to be like, hey, so, what's the update with your progress? Like a cookie. But you are a child. See, she's like, you're my child. <laughs> You've lost your innocence. <laughs> Ooh, his cream stew. I like cream stew. I'm a soup person. When I go to like the grocery store, I see the soup section. Like the grocery store has made themselves. Mm, I can't resist to get something. Mmm, so he's talking about when food is scarce, which correlates with the girl. That we saw in the beginning of the episode. Why? Did that person have like a lot of mana or something? <laughs> Little lady killer. Oh, he's going to be a lady killer for sure. Mm -hmm. 
I do like how they're showing this. Like it's infrared. The colorfulness of it. Kind of reminds me of what we have in our days. Like with the goggles. Where we see like heat signals. Or sensors. The dad seems like such a kind older man that it's kind of trippy seeing him in assassin mode. I mean, he looks like a dad. You know what I'm talking about? Like... <laughs> Okay, it's snowing. He's in the forest, so guarantee he's gonna see the girl. I'm gonna say her axe stalking its prey. There is a pack of wolves. Look at him. That animation's looking so good, giving me Attack on Titan vibes. Maybe it's because it's in the forest. Oh, but this animation looks so fluid, so smooth. Oh, look at that. See how he just landed in the ground and that wind just boom. And they're making sure to make the color colors of her eyes just pop. You know, that green thing is the theme, right? Dang! Those gloves! Final course severed. She's the bob. Wow! Very cool, very cool. Which is why he made those metal gloves. Oh, they're glaives. What glaives? All crushed, yo. Yeah, who are you? Who's you? Girl, you almost died. They had to reduce the number of mouths to feed. Mmm, so sad. Oh, he's like just like the bacon. He's comparing her to bacon. Don't trail off, girl. Just say that you want to work. You're going to go to the, you know, the place and ask for work. I thought it was stew, cream stew. Are you calling it porridge? I think he's telling her to eat slowly so she doesn't uh, still feel hungry. Maybe he wants her to savor it too. Favorite. Let your body absorb the food. Oh, no. So the body won't reject the food. Oh, I thought so she wouldn't feel hungry still. <laughs> What a day. What a day. Are you like What a day. 
Oh, God told her in a dream. Oh, the goddess is saying, yo, take her in. This girl is going to be helpful. Yeah, because the goddess said so. So these tears, see, no one's ever told me they needed me. That's why she's crying, yo. She's feeling needed. And she's gonna get a shelter and food. Yeah, you still think he's a good person even though he kills people? Hmm? What are the conditions, yo? Help him with his work. I like seeing the determination in her eyebrows. See in the eyebrows. Finally found someone with mana. <gasps> Yo! This was all... ...planned. Yo, he went psychological manipulation. <laughs> I forgot about this stuff. This is amazing. This is great. Brainwashing complete. <laughs> <laughs> So, he already wanted her, and then once he learned that he was sent by God, that just solidified it. Forty years ago, who's this? She changed her outfit. Why does she look like kind of like the dominatrix? What? Kill the hero? Again? Before? 40 years ago? Ago? Wait, he wanted to be reincarnated as a girl? And who were you born as? He's 40 years old. Ugh! I'll start trying for real tomorrow. This- Ugh! Oh, pathetic. I don't like pain. Finest soldier to a neat. Is he from the neighboring territory? That, uh, Tarte is from? We're definitely gonna see him again, huh? He's gonna be assassinated. Whoa! Why are made like characters have such big boobies. What's the deal with that? Okay? I'm just thinking about another anime. 
about the guy who kills things when he touches them. I like how the voice changes too for the character. They're showcasing the aging. Puberty. I like it. Because <laughs> she was so scrawny and skinny. Now she's a woman. That's a bit excessive, wiping his mouth. Yeah, see? He's seen it nicer. He's like, you don't have to perform it so diligently. Mmm. <laughs> The dad's talking about the assassin work. So my heart, my body, and life all belong to him. Because you make him wear girl clothes. Like, I'll serve him forever. Twelve years old, right? Huh. Oh, he's gonna feel for like the muscles and such, yeah. I can do the poses. Nothing sexual about this. All about work. He's got butt muscles, yo. Remember when he did it? He, he has such a scrawny butt. Very professional. I'm impressed with this. He'll never betray you. In two years, he acquired a body worthy of an assassin. Oh, that's right. In his previous life, he was going to be an instructor. This, this works out. You're perfect, girl. Intuition. Oh, he's like, you're dead. <laughs> I'm good with the spear, though. If I had a spear. <laughs> spear and a gun, right? She needs a gun. She needs a pew pew pow pow. No, a gun! She needs a gun! The one that we saw in the first episode! I like how they do show that she has flaws. 
Not very good with the knife. Oh, she is desperate! <gasps> oh, I thought that was the gun. I was like, oh, the gun! No, but it's a spear. Yo, she's so good with it! And... She knows it. We can totally see the confidence in this. She had like the dagger, the knife, the, the lack of confidence. Just like how I need you. Doing the brainwashing thing that he needs her. If you don't get up, I'll have to be mischievous. <laughs> so I didn't get that far in the manga. Does he ever hook up with any of these girls? Like, you know, crack. This the seducing part. I don't think he'll need to seduce anyone though. Oh. Attack by the boobies! Are we seeing this because time is passing by on her end? Like, why, why are we watching this? Why? Why are they showing this to us? Is this leading to the next episode? I can see that she's still studying. She's keeping up the work. Yeah, look at all those mana stones. <laughs> oh. This makes her seem really important. Because she's getting her own ending. Qualifications of assassins. And that's my reaction to the world's finest assassin episode 4. And it was mostly about Luke acquiring Tarte. Yes, and training her. This was a good episode about an additional character. I we actually how they got together and what I mean together you know group up you know party member acquired kind of thing and we saw the progress and how the relationship is in addition we got to see Luke grow up you know a couple more years we get to see what he's like now he's a little bit older more mature his voice changes we're seeing this progress here and Mm, the whole brainwashing part. Oh, that was good. That was deep, yo. It showed a lot of details in this story, which I really appreciate. But besides that, what did you think about the episode? What did you think about this video? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to talk outside of YouTube, there's a Discord. Link is in the description. I also stream on twitch.tv slash the host. If you watch these videos, do like stuff by the stream outside of YouTube and Twitch. I host podcasts across worlds where we talk about anime, manga, and other things you're interested in. If you like podcasts like that, link to the podcast is in the description. We're available on all platforms.
other than that, my name is Lehua, and this is the Superfina channel reacting to the world's finest assassin, episode 4. Hope you guys like this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Waiters!